This is the history of the most iconic sign in baseball, Wrigley Field's marquee. Wrigley was built in 1914, but it wasn't until 1934 that they built the marquee in hopes of attracting fans in the street to come watch the game. It was originally painted green and gold, and it said the Cubs instead of Chicago Cubs. At this time, the Chicago Bears also called Wrigley Field home, and they would get their team name on the marquee during football season. They realized pretty quickly that the marquee's green and gold colors were way too similar to their arch rivals, the Green Bay Packers. So just a year or two later, they had the marquee painted blue. It wasn't until the mid-1960s that it was painted its iconic iconic red color, and it got its new digital scoreboard in the early 80s. It has looked exactly the same ever since then, except for a couple short changes. In 2010, Wrigley hosted a Northwestern football game and the sign was painted purple for a few days. And in 2014, they painted it the classic green and gold colors to celebrate Wrigley Field's 100th anniversary. They actually kept these colors on the backside of the marquee, and you could check it out from Wrigley's concourse. And in 2016, the marquee got to light up with the words World Series Champions for the very first time. And make sure to like and follow for more ballpark history like this.